I'm on um, Loop 1604, which is the uh, outer loop of San Antonio. Um, and I'm close to the northeast corner of the loop. I just passed the Interstate 35 interchange. You can see the Balcones Escarpment right up ahead. Nacogdoches Road is the ancient uh, Spanish Camino Real. Uh, and uh, it's basically pretty much been a road for, what, 300 years? No. Yeah, between three and four hundred years. Balcones Escarpment is one of the, I think, one of the more interesting geological features in uh, Texas because you have this really fertile black soil of the Blackland Prairie, which is to the south and east of the uh, escarpment. And uh, there's farmland, there's grassland, but then once you cross it, you're all of a sudden in this very rocky limestone um, hills. And the uh, topography is made up of uh, caves, a lot of limestone caves. It's karst uh, topography. This is Nacogdoches Road here, and uh, the Spanish would um, travel along this corridor. The Balcones Escarpment was a natural barrier, so. Uh, it became a natural corridor. This is the Blackland Prairie. Um, the Blackland Prairie is quite recognizable because of the, uh, the wild sunflowers. There's one right there. Uh, the hackberry trees along the fence line. And of course this fertile black soil there's a cornfield over there to the right. here onto Evans Road. And then we'll cross the escarpment. This is the Cibolo Creek ahead of us. As soon as you cross the Cibolo Bridge, uh, you're in a little community of Bracken. And there's a famous uh, bat cave uh, in Bracken, Texas. I may be mistaken, but I believe it's one of the lar largest um, colonies of bats in the United States. Okay. So I'm now driving northwestward on Evans Road. northeastern extreme of Bear County. I'm still on the prairie, but not for long.
this is the escarpment right past we're pretty much on it now and this is where the dramatic change occurs Usually there's a increase in elevation of at least 100 feet. Within a very short period, of, a very short distance, maybe a half mile. several subregions. Um, the subregion we're in right now is called the Balcones Canyonlands. Um, it's one of the more scenic areas of the Edwards Plateau because um, of the dramatic hills, valleys, canyons that are eroded away um, with the limestone, that the water erodes the limestone creates all these different formations. Probably some of the more dramatic areas are um, in western Bandera County, uh, also in Hayes County near Wimberley, there's the, uh, the uh, Devil's Backbone. And the west side of Austin has some really nice hills and canyons. Once you cross the Balcones Escarpment, there's very little farming because the ground is too rocky. Um, there is, a, but uh, no more fields. It's all it's all limestone rock. Now we're. Uh, Beginning to turn turn westward here, uh, we're at the extreme northern edge of San Antonio. here mixed among the uh, new housing developments. 